Hello everybody, back here again for our vlog a day. Today is Saturday the 28th, I think 28th. I'm not sure what it is. 20th. Oh, it's Saturday, 28th, I'm pretty sure. So got this morning fairly earlier than normal. Um, way later than I used to for the longest time, but I've been sleeping in later. But got up, uh, got a couple things done, got the dogs out. Um, had a couple dogs getting dropped off today for daycare only. Uh, first one got here. Um, it was funny because the one was supposed to be dropped off way early and then they changed it back. They moved it back like two hours. So it is what it is. But yeah, um, got the first one dropped off. Everything was going good. Um, still had the little doodle here and they were playing around. Everybody's having fun. Everything's going good. And then I basically had the second one dropped off and the first dog got dropped off. Loves to play. He's She loves to play all the time and stuff with one dog doesn't do well with multiple dogs because like almost like it thinks it's going to be attacked from the back and i think it stands back to it's at a dog park a long time ago and it used to play with all the dogs and while i was playing with a couple dogs another dog came up from behind and really kind of attacked into it pretty bad to the point they didn't go to dog parks for a little while afterwards because they were really concerned about the attack the dog took and since then the dog now doesn't do well with groups of dogs it's sad because there's been times i'll have the dog here and i'll have like multiple dogs that i want to play and this poor dog who's scared to have other dogs that can't like they don't know where every dog's at like literally just sat behind me and the deck and just sat like right behind my lawn chair and stuff and whatnot and just like come on man just go play like you want to play i know you need to burn off some energy so every once in a while i'll do is i'll kind of separate out some of the dogs leave one dog out to play and it'll play once she realizes that the rest of the dogs are gone and then she'll play and get some good exercise and whatnot and stuff but it's just kind of hits a bummer because the dog would absolutely love to play a lot more in that process of having a lot more activity you know of multiple dogs but it is what it is so that dog um, the doodle went home so now i've got a couple dogs there and since the doodle went home it gave those two a chance to play and they wrestled and played and just had all the fun you could have it took her a little while to get used to the, their dog being gone but yeah they had a great time um, my wife had to run up and saw her dad he's up in rehab so i guess finds out that apparently even though they were supposed to do another test on his heart um they kept telling me they were going to schedule it, telling me no one was scheduled. It turns out, I guess, apparently the rehab doesn't work with the scheduling at all, even though they said they were going to. So, who the hell knows? It's, yeah. So, we're now got a call and trying to find out who's going to do the testing because they're doing an outpatient. <laughs> it is what it is. So, yeah, so much miscommunication. And some people are telling him one thing, other people are telling him another thing. And it just sucks when that happens. But it is what it is. So, yeah, went ahead. Um, she got back from there, had a couple things to get done around the place. Um, I did go out and um, had to go play with a hairless cat that one of my clients has that they left this morning to go over to Tampa, I think it is, to do some hurricane relief or something, like help rebuild some stuff, a friend of theirs or something. So he went over that way and did that. So I went and played with the cat. Um, he's pretty simple to deal with, but he did, wasn't very lonely yet because he hadn't been gone all that long. So he really wasn't too concerned about me playing. Normally he's super lovey and cuddle with me and stuff, but wasn't the case today, but it is what it is. So we hung out, um, got done with that, went for my run. And they left me a six pack of beer, which I don't drink beer, but who knows? Uh, it's one of the things I still, I'll take it, but I was on, I was starting my run with it. So I didn't take it cause I want to carry beer on my run. But I got back from my run, got myself a shower, um, went ahead and had one of the people go, Hey, we're about to pick the dog up or like 10 minutes out. I'm like, I just, I just got the shower. Give me a couple minutes. So they showed up. They actually went across the street, to the old house. And I don't know if they think I still live there. Cause they went there again, even though I had to meet them at this house again, but it is what it is. So they came, picked the dog up. Uh, everything was good there. And then later on in the evening, they came, picked up the dog that scared everybody. So now I'm down to just Luna and Bruce and it is what it is. But yeah, overall, um, end up outside, have myself a nice little cigar, have myself a nice little evening. A little chilly. Um, got that curtain put up, and it makes a big difference. That wind cuts down so nice. But yeah, the wind is open the house. Uh, as we went to bed, had a fan blowing out, so it is what it is. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. So anyway, that's all I got for right now. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe, wonderful day. Thanks for watching.